and we do solemnly bind ourselves and our constituents under the ties aforesaid to adhere to this association until such parts of the several acts of Parliament pass since the close of the last war as impose or continue duties on tea, wine, molasses, syrups, panels, coffee, sugar, pimento, indigo, foreign paper, glass, and painter's colors imported into America and extend the powers of the Admiralty Courts beyond their ancient limits, deprive the American subjects of trial by jury, authorize the judge's certificate to indemnify the prosecutor from damages that he might otherwise be liable to from a trial by his peers, require oppressive security from a claimant of ships or goods seized before he shall be allowed to defend his property, are repealed. And until that part of the act of the 12th George the Third, chapter 24, entitled An Act for the Better Securing His Majesty's Dockyards, Magazines, Ships, Ammunition, and Stores, by which any person charged with committing any of the offenses therein described in America may be tried in any shire or county within the realm is repealed. And until the four acts passed in the last session of Parliament, specifically that for stopping the port and blocking up the harbor of Boston, that for altering the charter and government of the Massachusetts Bay, and that which is entitled an act for the better administration of justice, etc., and that for extending the limits of Quebec, etc., are repealed, and we recommend it to the provincial conventions and to the committees in the respective colonies to establish such farther regulations as they may think proper for carrying into execution this association. The foregoing association being determined upon by the Congress was ordered to be subscribed by the several members thereof. And thereupon we have hereunto set our respective names accordingly. In Congress, Philadelphia, October 20th, 1774. Peyton Randolph, President. New Hampshire, John Sullivan, Nathaniel Folsom. Massachusetts Bay, Thomas Cushing, Samuel Adams, John Adams, Robert Treat Payne. Rhode Island, Stephen Hopkins, Samuel Ward. Connecticut, Eliphalet Dyer, Roger Sherman, Silas Dean. New York, Isaac Lowe, John Alsop, John Jay, James Duane, Philip Livingston, William Floyd, Henry Weisner, Simon Barham. New Jersey, James Kinsey, William Livingston, Stephen Crane, Richard Smith, John DeHart. Pennsylvania, Joseph Galloway, John Dickinson, Charles Humphreys, Thomas Mifflin, Edward Biddle, John Morton, George Ross. The Lower Counties, Newcastle, etc. Caesar Rodney, Thomas McKean, George Reed. Maryland, Matthew Tillman, Thomas Johnson, Jr., William Packa, Samuel Chase. Virginia, Richard Henry Lee, George Washington, Patrick Henry, Jr., Richard Bland, Benjamin Harrison, Edmund Pendleton. North Carolina, William Hooper, Joseph Hughes, Richard Caswell. South Carolina, Henry Middleton, Thomas Lynch, Christopher Gadsden, John Rutledge, Edward Rutledge. 
ordered that this association be committed to the press and that 120 copies be struck off. The Congress then resumed the consideration of the address to the inhabitants of these colonies, and after debate thereon, adjourned till tomorrow.